And of course, welcome to the show. My name is Barn Sechura. Every single Saturday, we happen to be here to bring you gospel music, Africa. What we do every single Saturday, two to four. We bring you gospel music, Africa. Sometimes we call it Musica, Africa. And of course, we started up with beautiful jams. Uh, of course, we played Damascus Sesanga, Dance Kumba. Yeah, yeah, kind of that song. Uh, one of the latest coming from Damascus Sesanga. And of course, we played Tanda Liple, getting back in times of day, you know, times of uh, uh, Tanda Liple. It was such an amazing jam by then. Everyone was really dancing upon Tanda Liple. And of course, it was a beautiful jam. And of course, we played also uh, Race T, of course, More Fire. And of course, we've been playing for you uh, a beautiful jam coming from Burundi, uh, coming from the MTC. One of the latest songs uh, coming from the MTC, Burundi. And of course, ladies and gentlemen, we salute everybody who is connected wherever you watch from. Uh, Google the TV, we appreciate you for, you know, hooking up with us uh, every single day in the week. And of course, we have much more on the show uh, tonight. We're going to talk about, we got a topic tonight so you can be part of the conversation back there at home as we look what are the major challenges or problems that have uh, into the gospel music back in our country. That's what we're going to talk about tonight with a couple of artists who are going to join us on the shows. We share with them how we can make gospel music Uganda uh, more, you know, more, 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 to rise it more and of course uh, uh, to get all the challenges that happen, uh, the artists really happen to face most of the time uh, when they happen to do their gospel music. So you can join us on our discussion, of course, back on our social media and uh, you can go to our Facebook page of course, Google the TV Uganda. You can put a comment of course tell us uh, how can we really make gospel music become more better and of course what are the kind of challenges that you happen to see uh, from the gospel parties and of course from the gospel music they happen to produce time uh, to time and of course we got a lot of news coming from Africa uh, we traveled back to you know eastern part of Uganda that is in the end of course Susanna Joy and the powerful Chris said and of course coming up on African news of course we got still so this in Doko a couple of artists have been really joining up back in Ghana for the Praise Nine. Uh, back in Ghana, I've seen a couple of artists here, yeah, Damasi Masika, and of course, uh, Todd Dallas, of course, Naya Chayin and Teka Teka, Zaba Bayimbi, Abagalo Kubanga, Bi Wandi, so Kubanga, Babeda album, so that you can feature on one of his albums, which is going to be a uh, producer. And of course, he has extended time towards uh, Ensongezo, Zaba Wandi. So if you got a beautiful jam, you can go to Todd Dallas still uh, on Instagram, or on Twitter, or on Facebook, and of course, uh, hook up with him. Uh, email Jedio, Jacobo Wandi. And because, of course, the winner is going to win. On uh, Kumiora Dola, Rubalu Kolera Nyo, Kabaka Senti, Kabaka Muzuli Nyo. So, of course, you can go there and join that. Of course, those are the news coming up. And, of course, on the show, uh, we got uh, my beautiful sister, Pastor, of course, Pastor Esther. Uh, she'll be joining us live from London, of course, as we share with her about uh, the music prospect. And, of course, how we can make the gospel music, you know, uh, play so much. The beats of gospel music from Uganda playing so much back in uh, uh, London. Of course, we shall have the conversation and, of course, to get to know her about her ministry and of course how we can push the gospel music back in London of course to make it super uh, viral and of course I got the guys coming up on the show the Neil Empire they've got a new song uh, which is on and we're going to talk about this new song still with uh, uh, the Neil Empire of course to get to know about the new project and of course how is the new project and of course uh, uh, compared to the uh, to the songs they've been producing you know the prospect is there uh, more blessing happening and of course more you know engaging with a, a couple of many girls parties around this country and of course around Africa. Is it really so working? Uh, so we're going to talk about that on the show. And don't forget to you know, subscribe uh, to our YouTube channel. Wali, again, ku YouTube. Wali, no subscribing. Kumukutu go fair. Wali, ako, no, tika kone, ka notification bell. Uh, in case, we're to post this, chitu chona chizo kubanga, chikutu kako, wali, ku YouTube and of course, ku Instagram. Ayongiro kubanga ogobele mi kutu jafeja Google TV Uganda, ku Facebook, ona. Atongiro kubanga tuju fule, nsonga mugwanga Uganda kuba yowe, yo kubanga emuli se Yo, Joe, so I chit to call every city. We sing a can't be the other day. It's beautiful back at home, of course. I uh, don't forget, you can see requesting that people jam that you say this is my jam. So, of course, Marcel and DJ right here. Of uh, course, Joe will be playing you that beautiful banger when you request it. You become your own DJ back at home. And of course, I got my DJ right here too. It's called Koja. Small time. We're gonna take a musical break. We're coming back with much more on the show. Koja, let's rock it again. If we jump, still coming. My DJ loved the song so much, he played it more time. And of course, uh, 
kabisa uh, tukumyo na mauli la gafa kukalu wa Afrika biche bifa wanu na wali tukita kumanga tukitu saa kovod yao o yongiro kumango tege den songa zaba imbi wa gospel biche bifa kola mukanyeme na kano uh, tukumyo kumanga tukitu saa kovod the gospel news Afrika nga tukumyo kumanga tuwa ya kubintu ebye eh, nja ulaba imbi bifa tuse kovod yao bifa funye obod yao bifa mnubidira o kumanga batu kaka kasera kona of course we are back with Africa news uh, katandi ke with us sister Zana Joy Beneza ministry uh, last time she called us to go and happen to be part of the crusade which she organized back in uh, Abuyende district of course Gwase uh, and of course it was really super amazing Abantu Abenjaulo got saved uh, we fetched a lot of souls out there in uh, Abuyende coincidentally nkuba yatonya nyoro nakolo yatukube mirundi jali nge satu na enkula ganti abantu abali uh, ku crusade ya Rosana Joy Beneza ministry jali tese tese uh, yali abantu bava wo basigala wo nkuba netonya na engo of course tuli mu mafuta we are praying worshiping and of course uh, uh, it was an incredible day and of course i salute i give a big five to my beautiful sister ozana joy and of course the people who attended of course the ebenezer uh, ministry couple of the brothers and of course uh, let me talk about all the people from itiana the brother from itiana he was really a great worship and of course the sister avali avetwali uh, nabonga tuliku crusade and of course it was really massive uh, so small time katulave bichebi ali ebuyende and of course how really it was super amazing because just more time let's have uh, ozana joy Of course, Ozana was saying, upon this ministry, she's going to take this uh, crusade towards the whole uh, country of Uganda. And of course, many pastors really appreciated a couple of these people, the artists, and of course, the Ebenezer uh, you know, ministry for having this dream of saying, we got to take uh, the crusade uh, back in town. And of course, people were really super happy. And of course, we still have much more. But of course, if you want to find more about how it went, you can really just miss Ozana Joy a uh, YouTube uh, YouTube channel and of course you can really find all this incredible uh, you know the night was a night of worship a night of praying to God and of course the people from Buyende and of course when the rain came but of course by the power of God and the grace of God I was upon these people and of course we stayed up to it rained up to lay in the morning really it was really a super amazing coming from my beautiful sister Ozana uh, joy and of course talking about uh, the genesis has been viral everybody now is posting uh, something on facebook back in our country in uganda at uh, the genesis concert which the vixen number is where we going to get to go uh, so of course everyone has been posting and of course number was a dream for the vixen back in time but of course even up to now many people now are saying we gotta do this as born again and of course there's people who love the vixen music so genesis is coming up and of course the concert is gonna be huge so people are really spreading the news back on facebook on twitter and of course on instagram levixon himself but of course promoting at the genesis concert and of course i was speaking to a couple of people and said especially someone was saying let's make this a huge concert for our brothers christian and born again if it happens to be there let's all go there to support our 
our own. Most of the time, our own, of course, is a brother, and of course, doing a lot of things coming up from uh, uh, Levixon. So, yeah, and of course, coming back from the Genesis concert, which will happen anytime. I'm going to forget my new told Darren from the USA is still on. And of course, in the video, he was saying he has extended the time of those people who would really wish uh, to participate into, you know, to write a song which will feature on his new album, which is going to come out. And of course, to the winners, uh, you got to have something that you're going to win. And of course, it is incredible. Bobo Wandi Solimbaro to a match to be that song which has been selected. Uh, it is really like back in our country in Uganda. There is a way we're representing the gospel back in our country and the way we're representing uh, the message. And of course, that message that you got uh, that you're going to happen to write. Wali Kumunga, the gospel now is sold outside. And of course, when you sign up, that it becomes better if your song has been featured. So, small time we got told Dallin uh, speaking upon that, uh, the extension of the days. Kojal, small time, let's have him. Okay, yes, Kavidia. thank you guys. Good morning. Um, just want to let you know we decided to extend the um, the deal, the one that we were going to shut off yesterday. You guys are, are really, really the support is is unreal. I mean, I know that you guys are getting. A lot out of the deal but it's still cool that you guys will trust um this company with your music all right and so um uh, thank you for that and we extended it to the end of the week um i meant what i said though like because of you know that deal being what it is that means i gotta sit in front of zoom and just really you know kind of be there a lot because i notice you guys are just blowing this one up but that's cool though um because you found a package that you seem to just really love so if you haven't gotten in on it yet it's cool you have to the end of the week um, for the one song, um, fully produced consultation with me for one thousand dollars. All right, click the link in my bio or go over to DelaneyLandMusic.com to check it out. All right. Uh, if you gotta win, I, you know, I really give it to people. Uh, you know, when we happen to follow these people, and of course, if we happen to, you know, follow up the challenges that are being put by those international uh, gospel artists around the world, there is a way our music can really go super viral. But you see, uh, the music when I was speaking to one of my sister back in Nigeria, uh, she was saying like, uh, you see now Nigeria has crossed so much because of the connections and of course because of the engagement with a couple of artists more over the West and uh, uh, from the West and of course from the USA still that's how these people are engaging one another of course I still have some uh, video which will come into the second hour uh, when Deborah Rukalu was performing live in Washington DC on Mijabu a uh, concert which was opened by of course these are Congoli brothers and sister uh, they happened to call their brothers from Af from Africa to go and then worship with them mainly people from Congo but of course we still lack this but I got a pastor Esther who is in London should be really telling us why they don't organize such big events uh, for you know gospel artists like back in London to see how we can uh, uh, make gospel music uh, super viral. It's more time. We got to take a musical break. We're coming back with the uh, pastor Esther on the show. Let's rock it. I